Anyang, everybody. I just want to take the request of Atika, Farjian He, um, Minhi Lee, Hisa Mishari, Icha Boise Master, and Paul Bird. Sorry if I mispronounce your names, everybody. But I'm gonna take your request, and I'll be doing Vic's error. Wow, this already looks interesting. I don't, I don't know what's coming, but this. Oh, the cyborgs. Okay. You know, half machine, half people. Okay. And then he's a scientist. Okay, so she's also a cyborg, okay? But I couldn't erase you. Okay. That's a good effect, I like that. I don't want to ruin myself anymore. I suppose since the name of the song is Error, he keeps mentioning erasing the girl the way you would erase information off a hard drive or off your phone, and think in comparing memory to the memories you have in your brain to the memory on a computer or a memory card or something. So it's a nice uh, analogy they have going on here. So perhaps he feels that him fixing her arm is him fixing the relationship or something like that. See, insert memory. So he's making the girl or the cyborg girl remember their relationship because he backed it up on a hard drive. I was really hoping there were gonna be more of the the cyborgs I saw at the beginning of the video. Yeah, I thought there would be more of the group. In no, wait, what? She's illegal, or the, their love is illegal, I don't know. I thought this video was gonna be one way at the beginning and it's now too dramatic for my taste. This is so... <laughs> ah.
Is that a cyber heart? Okay. What we have here is a scientist at the, at the beginning of the video who's already made cyborg guys, which you see lined up. But there's a special female cyborg that reminds him of a girl he once had a relationship with and he wants to put the memories in her so that she can remember what the relationship was like and why he's missing her. But then he can't because that's like him falling in love with a fucking robot. Which is why the guys came in and stopped him, because he's falling in love with a robot. The love between him and that cyborg is forbidden, because she has a cybernetic pussy. What could have made this, I think, more productive is if they took their robot concept and saved it for something more upbeat, a different song, a follow-up single or something like that. This way, perhaps, when it comes to the digital thing, instead of it being about memories and remembering a girl it could instead be about compatibility you could show more corrupt more corruptions or more errors in their appearance and also just in their relating to each other i don't fully believe that he and the woman really interacted as man and woman she was a doll almost which i think is a little creepy in not the coolest way they spent a lot of money on this video and i was really hoping for something more awesome to result from it. It's like an embarrassment of riches. It costs so much money, but in the end, there is something unintentionally creepy about this. I don't think they made it creepy. It's still a guy being emotional about robots. It's fine, but it just makes him look creepy. And I know in the K-pop video, they're trying to sell the guy off as being masculine and suave. And I didn't get that impression, so. I guess because I know they spent a lot of money on it and it didn't result in what I think is awesome, I have to deduct a bunch of points and give this a five and a half. I don't know, it costs a lot of money, but I, I, I wasn't moved by this one, guys. What do you think? Oh, man. That, that's what I saw. Like, at the beginning of the video, I thought for some reason they would be, like, really cool montages of him and the girl having like some like sick dance routine where parts of their body would turn robotic or something. That to me would have had a more upward swing to things than just him being like, oh, my robot. Oh. It's like, I just, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't. Just saying. I'm an actual guy, so if I see a phony example of masculinity, I can sense it pretty clearly you know and it was it was just so artificial like it, like the lead actor was trying to act rather than just acting purely from the inside just not as awesome as it was meant to be 